Hey you guys, this is Chanel here, and in number two's tip video of uh, steps to finding referrals on Facebook, I'm going to show you guys what you guys need to do. So in your step two, what you guys is going to need to do, you're going to need to create a new Facebook profile just for marketing purposes only, okay? So which means that you're going to need a new gmail account so be sure to create a new gmail account to make your gmail account just for business purposes so uh, your gmail email can go a little something like this um let's say branding sj at gmail.com or network network marketing gmail.com i mean g at gmail.com it can be whatever you want your email address to be, but you must use that Gmail account to create you a brand new Facebook account. So once you created your brand new Facebook account, now you can use that Gmail account for business purposes only. So when you sign up to new programs, you will have all your emails coming to just that business Gmail account. So those are the two things that you want to focus on today, which is in your step, uh, your step two, your tips for today. You want to focus on creating your Facebook profile and creating your Gmail account. Now, here are some of the things that you need to get started doing. So don't go adding your family and your close friends to it unless they are like-minded individuals like yourself. But here on my Facebook page, I do not add my, uh, sorry about that. I do not add my friends or family members or classmates on this Facebook page because this Facebook page has a purpose. And the purpose only is so that you can brand yourself and market yourself with like-minded individuals that's going to follow you in what it is that you do online. Okay, so you want to put up a profile a picture of yourself okay now you also want to grab some more other photos and upload those photos here as well so that people can know who you are get to know you and know that this is not just a random Facebook page these people here need to know that you are a real human being behind this Facebook page because the purpose is to connect with people uh, so that they can follow you and so that you can build a relationship with them so that you can also get them engaged in what you are posting on your Facebook wall. That interests them would be the same offer that offers that are similar to each to one another that you are currently in. Okay. So um like i said post uh, post pictures and make sure, like post pictures of maybe you and a few pictures of your family you together so that you know only pictures that you feel comfortable with sharing to, with the public because this is social media if you think about it at the end of the day you guys you know pictures are floating around everywhere of social media of you if you do not even know you know so just post pictures that you don't mind sharing with people so that you're you can start getting your uh, profile up and going and up here at the top you can pretty much google search and uh, get like a inspirational quote or something so or a motivational uh, uh, quote let's say motivational Facebook cover quote okay so those pop up as well you guys and click on image and you see a whole lot of different ones here that you can actually put on your Facebook uh, photo cover up here so it's real simple okay so in this lesson you guys you want to prepare your profile before you start adding people do not add anyone I'm going to do another um, step, stop, step by step video that's going to uh, uh, allow you, it's going to give you instructions to 
what to do next as far as adding people and to get them follow you on uh, your new marketing Facebook profile okay so uh, so you want to definitely get your page set and ready okay so that you can have enough content and so on there without offering uh, your new people current currently offers that you have currently available you don't want to start marketing to them about offers that you have available right now you just want to number one create your uh, uh, Facebook page number two well let's say number one create your Gmail account okay Gmail account number two create your profile picture well not create your profile picture but upload your profile picture and number three you want to uh, Google search some motivational quotes and put them up there and then number four you want to uh, grab you some pictures some more motivational quotes uh, or either some images that um, interest that are like-minded in individuals so if you're like into matrix or bitcoins and stuff like that you can find articles and images that deals with Bitcoin and do not put any offers or referral links or anything on there you can have an image about wisdom okay have something about wisdom and you can put in uh, comments I mean not comments in type in the post about some kind of wisdom that uh, based on how you feel about that image that you put okay for an example so here's one I'm going to say it starts within you the outcome ends because of your actions so I've already downloaded that image from Google that I uh, want to add and I am now going to go and go to my downlo downloads, find it, and it's here. And this is what you will be posting on your Facebook wall to get people engaged in what you are posting when you get ready to add them and to send them a Facebook request, request okay? So you basically want people to get, in, get engaged in your postings, okay? So that's one of the things that, see how fast Emily Mitchell just engaged in my post? This right here shows you it can be done. This is how it all works and all starts. Now you're going to end up getting some comments because this is what you want, you guys. You want people that you add first. You don't want to share no offers with them. You want them to... To, to see what you're about okay see this gives them an idea what kind of mindset you have where you want to go with this why you created your 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 post okay why you created this Facebook page so throughout the steps so today's focus is creating that email address creating a new email account create a new Facebook page upload Facebook image I mean a Facebook profile and a Facebook cover and start posting um, maybe three let's say three three comments I mean three postings and and whatever you want to post about every day okay every day three postings a day on your Facebook wall do not add anyone yet you should have no friends and no followers okay so you guys know in the previous video I mentioned that in video number one tip number one I mentioned that I'm going to show you how to get followers I'm going to show you how to build your audience and I'm going to show you how to put contents on your Facebook page just like I did just now and I'm going to show you how to find the right audience and how to target the right people to be the right audience so do not do it do not go ahead of yourself please be patient okay so be looking out for that next video which will be tip number three